Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will tell you how to get the motion blur feature in CapCut and how to use it too. But before that, please subscribe to this channel first and turn on the notification if you have just joined this channel. Because it is a new feature, to get the motion blur feature, you must update the CapCut app on your smartphone to the latest version. For Android smartphones, open the Google Play Store service. Search for CapCut in the search box. Then if you are still using the old version of CapCut, update it. I assume you already have the latest version of CapCut. So now open the app, create a new project, then as an example, I'll add 5 photos to the project. After that, I'm also going to set the duration of all these photos to 1.5 second. And then, save. Create a new project again. Then add a video from the photos you saved earlier. Tap the video clip on the track like this. Then look for a menu called Motion Blur, and open. Here, will appear some adjustments for you to set. The first is the blur setting. The higher the blur you set, the smoother the transition will appear. The second setting is blend. The higher the number, the more frames will be blended. The third is directions. You can choose between forward, backward, or both. And the last one is the times. The more amount you choose, the smoother the motion blur effect will appear. You can follow the settings I set, or set it yourself. Then next, tap on this tick button to apply. Up here, wait for the process of applying the motion blur effect to finish. And yeah, at this moment, we have finished using the motion blur feature in the CapCut app. Now, let's see the results. Okay guys, I think that's enough, a tutorial on how to get the motion blur feature in the CapCut app, and how to use it too. I hope this video helps, and thanks for watching.